good morning my dear student i am professor kamle dp today we discuss about the wind uh, windmill power plant in this topic we discuss classification of the windmill and site selection for the windmill okay wind energy is an indirect form of solar energy and wind is created due to uneven heating of the earth wind turbine is a device that convert the kinetic energy of the wind into the electrical energy okay now classification of the windmill first based on the orientation of the axis of the rotor in this there are two type horizontal axis and vertical axis okay <clears throat> next based on the rotor propeller type next multiple multiple blade type 7s type and deres type okay the pro propeller type and multiple blade type are horizontal axis and 7s and deres type are vertical axis okay most commonly used windmill are propeller type with two or three blade for economical reason two blade for two blade design are more cost effective but it faces to the difficulty of vibration three blade design are used for power generation because of its rotor naturally balanced okay vertical axis this vertical axis windmill use blade either 7s type or deres type 7s type have a s shape due to this this type of rotor are called as a s rotor and deres rotor type consist of two or three convex blade with a aerofoil cross section okay the main advantage of the vertical axis is it can generate power with the with the wind coming from any direction okay next type is based on power rating okay first micro turbine mini turbine then commercial turbine then medium turbine and large turbine if the power rating less than 0.25 kW then it is a micro if less than 1.4 kW then mini mini turbine if uh, <coughs> power rating is less than 100 kW then commercial if power rating is less than 1000 then medium turbine and power rating is less than 3000 this is a large turbine okay now we discuss site selection of the wind power plant okay the main consideration in the selection of the site uh, site for wind power plant are based on its technical feasibility economics total you know uh, social uh, environment and other con uh, other consideration some of the important criteria for the selection of the site are located first <coughs> located where high average wind velocity available are in the range of 6 meter to 30 meter per second throughout the year okay second the wind power plant must be located away from the cities and forest because because building and forest offer resistance to the air movement third located in located in flat open areas so wind velocity so wind velocities are higher high in this location next <clears throat> ground surface should have high soil strength okay site should be next site should be away from the localities because of sound pollution caused by wind mills okay next uh, site should have low land cost and near the consumer to reduce the total cost of the installation and reduce the transmission losses next tower tower design must be enough to withstand the maximum wind speed okay thank you